little bit more of those um, the density and my god why can't I speak with this one <laughs> realize so I do realize I give up honestly truly I give up okay this is annoying Hey my beautiful people, how's it going? As always, I hope you guys are doing fantastic. So today I'm here to bring you a brand new wig. You see her, yes, it is this bad boy right here. Okay, before we hop into it, you know we gotta get into her. Okay, get into it. Yes, boo-boo, I'm here to give you all the details on this fierceness right here. Okay, this wig was sent to me courtesy of BlackHairSpray.com. And if you're not familiar with them, they're pretty much an online beauty supply store. Um, they have an array of things, so many different wigs you can choose from, lace, synthetic, whatever you need, um, Remy hair, ponytails, buns, etc., etc. So if you're looking for any of those type of things, definitely make sure you check them out. I will have everything listed down below okay but they sent me this and i love her okay i love her this is by the brand known as outre okay and her name is jada not related to jada pinka smith <laughs> no corny <laughs> okay but no her name is jada and the color is I'm trying to remember off the top of my head i don't know but i will have it right here um, but this color is, whew, whew, I don't think you've ever seen me in this color. Um, it's been a long time since I've rocked like reddish hair a really long time. I don't even know how many years it's been. Um, but yeah, to my channel, to you guys, I don't think you've ever seen me in red hair. So I want to do something a little different and not get the typical colors you've seen me in. Uh, so yeah, I got this color and baby, this color is bold. Okay, now... It's like a red, pink, magenta type of thing. Um, it's kind of hard for me to explain, and I don't know if my camera's going to truly pick up the real color. You know, my lighting in here is not that great. Um, but it is reddish, but to me, it's not like this blood red. It's not a... I don't know. I'm trying to see how I'm going to describe this. It's really kind of red, pinkish, magenta turn a certain side maybe a little hint of purple it's just a different type of color but i like it i like it um now at first when i put it on i was like because you know I, I like i said it's been a long time since i've rocked hair this color but you know once i put her on and really was wearing it for a while i got used to it and now i'm just like yes yes and more yes okay so this unit just really screams fall to me which is why i got it because i think it's just gonna look great for the fall season going into the winter um and what i like about this unit is that they always kind of have like this dark root going fading into the color i think that's very necessary to make it look a little bit more realistic because i feel like if it didn't have this darker root it might be a little bit like Ugh. So I really can appreciate the darker root going into the color. And you know, don't be afraid to experiment with color, okay? It's a wig. This is what you use wigs for, okay? You use wigs to experiment with things that you probably don't want to do on your real hair. So don't be afraid, okay? This color is bomb, okay? Now, I mean, if you really timid, then you might not want to go this route, but don't be afraid. Jada don't bite, okay? Jada gonna hook you up. This is a synthetic lace wig, okay? It did come with lace all in the front that i cut off the lace is hard okay which you know nobody really likes but it is what it is what can you expect i also really like the way the wig looks um i love the density and the luster of it uh definitely wasn't too shiny even straight out the packet like it has this nice yakky look to it um where i think it can somewhat mimic african-american hair a little <laughs> um but yeah it wasn't too shiny it's nice and full it's a full wig if i bring all the hair up to the front this is all of it up to the front it's nice and full which i like um i'll trade the last couple of wigs i've been having from them have really been like the bomb and this is no exception so i really like the length as well i thought it was going to be a little bit longer but um it's not it hits me like right at the top of my boobs sorry 
um but yeah it hits me like right there um and i'm five seven so yeah i i think it's a great length actually so as far as the parting goes i did tweak it a little bit um i did try to pluck a little bit of hair off and i did apply some concealer and powder because um if you see with this clip i'm about to insert now um this is what it looks like straight out the bag and uh yeah the parting is mm, yeah I feel like it definitely needs some tweaking to make it look a little bit more realistic and I feel like you can even do more than what I did. I just kind of did the minimum um, but it's cool. It works for me uh, but I mean it's not terrible but I definitely think you should tweak it a little to your liking and it did come in the middle part. Y'all know me. I love middle parts so I ain't mad at that. Um, You can probably try to shift it around if you want a side part or any type of things. You know you kind of just have to play with it. You know do your thing. Now as far as the inside of the wig, this is what it looks like, okay? This is the parting right here. Um, and it has two combs here. And it also has a comb at the bottom. Hopefully you can see that. And it also has the adjustable straps, which is always important for me. Like, I love for a wig to have adjustable straps, because as you can see, I adjust the wig to my head, which is major key. So, yeah. Now I did wear the wig for a few days, uh, but I have to take her off because I have some other things to review for you guys. Um, but when I did wear it, uh, as far as shedding was concerned, it did shed a little, okay, it did shed a little, but it wasn't a lot. Um, and I think some of my shedding came from the fact that I was plucking the part. Um, I think that's where most of my shedding was coming from because other than that, I didn't really get much. As far as tangling, if this wig is like any of my other outro wigs, um, which I think it will be because they all pretty much have this similar texture, um, you may experience just a little bit of tangling. Um, and I don't want to necessarily say tangling, but it's kind of be like a mat matted kind of stick together type of thing if that makes sense so now like I feel like you know you can definitely run your fingers through the hair um it looks all nice but eventually as time goes on and the more you wear the wig it may clump together a little bit at certain parts so you know I feel like you always want to make sure you got your brush on deck okay necessary major key um but yeah just kind of make sure you keep it brushed okay and um you know when you get home at night time take that bad boy off don't sleep in your wig okay um but yeah, other than that i think the wig is gonna do a okay this wig was pretty easy to work with uh which i really like i like wigs that i don't have to do too much to make it look good um like i said the only thing that really i had to work on was the parting and you know you can really just do that with some concealer so yeah straight out the back you can just plop her on cut your lace off fix that parting and you're good to go all right, so I think that's pretty much it. Jada, I will be seeing you again, honey, okay? Um, definitely make sure you check out Jada. Make sure you check out blackhairspray.com. Like I said, I will leave all of their links down below, including this unit. And if you're new here, I would love to have you, okay? Come join the family. Come ride this wave, 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 wave. What? Why I always gotta dance? Why I gotta always just be, why I gotta be extra? I'm, I'm a chill. I'm going to Psych. <laughs> but no, like, comment, subscribe, all that good stuff. And until my next video, I hope you guys stay beautiful, stay blessed, and I'll see you soon. Bye, guys.